be the Kadar radio tower. Means the lab's not far. Come on. Check. Good? You, you know you don't have to. Sooner or later, they'll know who you really are. You withhold it. You withhold it. Why do you think that is? Think you are. What are you resisting? What are you resisting? Is it you are It's only a matter of time. What are you waiting for? Don't. Help me. You're nearly there. You're trying to stop. Stop the fight. Something dangerous. Getting in there, not with those turrets in place. Generator here. That did it. Now, are you ready to get some answers? More than ready. upset about a pinprick i have sensitive hands proper identification is required for entry your entry has been denied good day a uh, what niles is that you proper identification is required for entry proper identification hey you can give it a shot but it's gonna hurt more than you think that welcome home? Do you really require an explanation? I think I like the gibberish spouting novels more than this cryptic garbage can. Ah, I see you've met my vastly inferior construct at New Hope. This way. What the hell? It's freezing in here. Goodness. Apparently, some of our cryojets are malfunctioning. There must be a fault in our system. You don't say! Of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. Would you mind terribly? 
miserable little garbage can, mother. Cryo jets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Get back to that car. Well done. Yeah, Jack's good. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. you explaining this. Oh, nothing but the remains of an old industrial accident. No, the stains. Same as the ones at New home. Yeah, I noticed. Ah, yes. My work there began as an effort to cure children ill with rust lung, but it grew into something far more significant. The cog wanted medicine. I gave them darts. Oh, well. Water under the bridge. Please, this way. So after the cog shut you down, why come all the way out here? Our family needed a place to continue our work in solitude. <laughs> no way your family built this alone. I am quite certain you lack the necessary clearances for that information. This next area is quite fascinating. The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own. Especially interesting. What is it? That is one of our first successful hybrids. Hybrid? You mean a locust? One and the same. In our previous facility, we had problems with genetic stability. The sires were distempered and sterile, a problem for obvious reasons. But the locusts were different, highly controllable, the perfect soldiers, and blessedly able to reproduce. What made them different? Their cells. You see, the emulsion miners' children provided a marvelous genetic repository, as did the indigenous creatures of the Hollow. In all of your genetic research, it's in here? Of course. Oh, oh shit. Hey, hey, Jack, Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. 
But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira, or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mira's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Reyna. Your mother. What? You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey, what are you... Why did you come here with me? What did J.D. tell you? Hey, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the Locust. Now, shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. It killed her. I killed her. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. What? I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. It... You think? Or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just... I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. Okay. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me My grandfather. Who was he? One of my best geneticists. He fled with little Reyna because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Reyna had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. Ah, 
He's done it. Your little friend is quite handy. Hey, watch it, Thomas Cam. Check's both. Well, you do make a lovely couple. Would you please follow me? Almost there now. I'm curious. How does it feel to have your life's work turn on you? I choose to view it differently. The Locust longed for independence. Mirror showed them the way. I have always been proud of your grandmother. I still am. What the hell is that thing? The Matriarch was generated from your grandmother's stem cells and Sire DNA. She amplified Mirror's ability to communicate with the Locust. is where Mira first learned to control her power, but we can also use it to sever your link, if you choose. So how does it work? By mildly damaging your brain. What? By mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the Locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. It sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind, undetected, to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood. <laughs> I will make this as painless as possible. Yeah, you better. Okay. 
Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, but... Okay, come on. We can talk about it later. No, listen. He used me. My mother... She's alive. What? It, it wasn't really her, except... Except it was... Where is he? Emergency shutdown. In effect. Come on. He went this way. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! After him! Get back here, Niles! God damn it! Shit! Surely you see I've done you a kindness. You are no longer vulnerable to the high mind and your mother has been awakened. Well, so to speak. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you! I don't think you can hear us. I don't give a shit! Stop. Look for a way through. I'm gonna make you pay. You're not gonna do anything but freeze if we don't lift this lockdown. Niles is talking about? Later, after we deal with Niles. Every child needs a playmate. Have fun. Joe? I see it, I see it! Uh... Let's take him down! Focus! 
You see, what you don't realize, what none of you realize, is that my children will never die. They have been designed to withstand generational conflict. They may withdraw, they may hibernate, but they will always return. We have seen to that. I am really looking forward to shutting that garbage can up! I'll take that! Jack, shock trap! <laughs> Okay, it looks like we're clear. Let's keep moving. Niles can't get away. Locked. There's got to be a way to open it. Maybe there's something Jack can do. Jack, see where that leads. <laughs>
Let's get after Niles. Time to go. inside its head. You don't want to know. Where the hell is Niles? My goodness. Someone seems to have awakened my sires from their long hibernation. I wonder who that could have been. Del, get ready! Let's keep after Niles. Come on. Hey, Niles! We're still coming! I really don't think he can hear I really don't care! I'm taking this. open.
Tell, Niles is leaking something. Looks like he went this way. Oh, we got you, you son of a bitch! Damn it! Undone. This planet is now theirs. I told you I'd get you. Look out!
things are linked to me, right? Well, get ready to switch off! It was real. Okay, then maybe she'll, I don't know, I mean, help us somehow. She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? Their queen. Come on, time to get out of here. got their queen. And Nas is right about what happens next. We need a new plan. No, we need the old plan. We need the Hammer of Dawn. Oh, thank God. Looks like you need a ride. How'd you find us? You think I'm gonna give you a one-of-a-kind piece of tech without the ability to track it to the center of the planet? Yeah, yeah, fine. And speaking of one-of-a-kinds, help me hook up this skiff. You find what you're looking for? Yeah. And now we need to kill it. Is she, you know, all right? Not really. But let me ask you something. How long would it take to get the Hammer of Dawn up and running? Funny you should ask. The data drive you found months ago about the UIR. Yeah? Interesting stuff. Interesting how? You'll see. And lucky for us, I have an old UIR contact. Take us home, Sam. Got it, sweet cheeks.